Okay, so hi guys, it's Alice and Marie, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you are new. So, um, as you can tell by my screen, there's a lot of, there's some new sim news. Um, basically, I was scrolling through uh, Google to find some new, um, maybe, I, I was sc really scrolling to see if I could find any new ideas for videos and then I came across this um, link from Instant Gaming that said The Sims 5 release date. It said, it said The Sims 5 is going to be released sometime in 2023. And I thought that I should um, comment on this because The Sims team said it was going to be a couple of years but I found this from Instant Gaming now. I don't know how credible this is. I have no honest honestly no idea how credible it is but I found it and it says that you can get e notified by email when it's in stock and here's basically the reason why I wanted to share this with you was because it basically it gives kind of like a synopsis of what they say the Sims 5 is going to be like so it says the Sims 5 for PC will be the fifth main game in, an enormous, in the enormous franchise which has been double digit multiples of expansion packs adding to each game's universe. This game coming out soon carries hopes of fans that it continues the the fine tradition of reflecting our own world back at us, albeit in a zany Sims kind of way. The following are best guess details of what the game will include as little has yet been confirmed. Um this is what they say The Sims 5 is going to be like. Nothing has been 100% confirmed, but this is what they say is supposedly coming to The Sims 5. The Sims 5 for PC will be the fifth main game in the enormous... F I already just read that. It's lovely. The new game concentrates on social interaction and competi on competition, according to the game's developers, who, will like, who like to give long-term players what they want. Accordingly, look out for the open world exploration of the type that made Sims 3 so popular. The instant porting enabled in Sims 3 was disappointing to many diehard fans. The open world format enables you to interact with your immediate neighbors and perhaps even further afield. In fact, you can help to craft the kind of neighborhood you want using the new and improved neighbor building tools. Literally building a community for your Sims to enjoy and thrive in. Some kind of reverse Pied Piper bid. Toddlers are back giving are back having been snatched away in the initial Sims 4 offer. Babies which are present in the Sims 4 but limited to their cribs are now free range so you can cuddle your Sims baby without being without them being tied to the home. Finally look out for the new and exciting NPC characters who will do their best to spice up your Sims lives or get them into trouble. So, the, so that's what they kind of say is the gist of what the game is about. And then it goes into the nitty gritty. New to Sims 5 is a highly anticipated multiplayer option, which we already knew. It's a great way to connect with your friends and it is cross-platform cloud-based play. Which means that it doesn't matter which console your friends have. Graphics and character design are more polished while building designs are, is also improved. The new game features a creative marketplace, which ties into multiplayer offer. This means that you and your sims can craft items for the players in exchange for goods or simoleons. Once the game lands, at, at a date still to be announced, anything deemed to be missing by players will almost certainly be provided with, certain, with future expansion packs and or DLC downloadable content, as the developers are very good at giving players what they want to keep them coming back for more. What the Sims might look like. Sims are finally moving over to a platform which is expected to offer even better looking Sims. The current flat platform for Sim customization is one that has been used since the first Sims game and is well overdue for an upgrade. These are just some of the things you can expect from your new Sims, your new look Sims. Realism. New Sims will be even more detailed and realistic than before, with a wide range of skin tones, body shapes, and accurately plotted movement when they run and walk. You. Your Sim can even look like you. If you use your camera and to take a scan of your face, so you can feel even more immersed in your Sims activities than you already do. 
Dress up. Your Sims can wear even more diverse clothing than ever before. You can experiment with national dress, try on try out different styles to find your unique look, or simply change up your clothes as off, often as you like to in real life. The Sims 5 for PC would be available to purchase on Instant Games for a fraction of the retail price. Blah, blah, blah. We don't care about that. Because <laughs> um, we don't um, endorse paying less than what the EA offers it to be. Because who knows whether or not that's real. Um, but basically what it seems like, it seems like that The Sims 5 is everything that players want. Now this is all speculation. This could actually be all accurate. This could be all a complete and utter farce. Um, we just don't know. But, as I said, I was just scrolling through Google, scouring the internet, and this article came across, um, and it came across my, not I just saw it, and, I'm, and I read it briefly, and I thought I should, you know, let you guys know, because the hook of it was by The Sims 5 on Origin, which, as we know, Origin isn't current, isn't really being used by them anymore. But it seemed to be kind of like a listing for The Sims 5, so I was hoping to maybe get a little bit more information out of what The Sims might, what The Sims 5 might include. And it feels like we kind of got that in this. So um, it, this is really probably just out of the woods. Probably nothing is probably confirmed besides multiplayer. Um, but I thought I found it. I thought I would show it with you guys, share it with you guys. Uh, and let me know what you guys think down in the comments down below, um, because I don't know, I don't know what to think at this point with it, um, because it seems a little bit far-fetched, but you never know. Um, so yeah, um, if you guys liked today's video, don't forget to leave it a like and share it with your friends or anyone you think might like it, and yeah, as always, I love you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys! Thank you.